Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Buenos días, hola, caballeros y señoritas. Espero que pasen todos un buen día. Hello, hello. Nodrick and Cordell here. This is the next part of our poetry book reading. And uh, we read 20 poems of love and one song of despair by Pablo Neruda. Before we start, I'd like um, to remind you that uh, if you want to check out the videos of Natrick, she has her YouTube page. All you have to do is to uh, do a research on Karen Natrick. Uh, if you found this video, obviously you know where it is, so just leave us a like if you enjoyed it. or subscribe to well be aware of the new videos that will come and um, except that we also have a discord where we talk uh, regularly and do poetry reading every evening at 8 p.m t p.m 8 p.m gmt plus one which is uh, greenwich time plus one england plus one if you prefer yeah, on this join words. us on in there. <laughs> on this word, we shall start reading the poems. Please, Kara, take the stage. I have gone marking. I have gone marking the atlas of your body with crosses of fire my mouth went across a spider trying to hide in you behind you timid driven by thirst stories to tell you on the shore of evening sad and gentle doll so that you should not be sad a swan a tree, something far away and happy, the season of grapes, the ripe and fruitful season. I, who lived in a harbor from which I loved you, the solitude crossed with a dream and with silence, pinned up between the sea and sadness soundless, delirious, between two motionless gondoliers, between the lips and the voice, something goes dying, something with the wings of a bird, something of anguish and oblivion, the way nets cannot hold water, my toy doll, only a few drops are left, trembling, even so, something sings in these fugitive words, something sings, something climbs to my ravenous mouth, oh, to be able to celebrate you with all the words of joy. Think, burn, flee, like a butterfly at the hands of a madman. My sad tenderness, what comes over you all at once? When I have reached the most awesome and the coldest summit, my heart closes like an octurnal flower. This was a really nice reading, Nordic. Thank you very much. Thank you. And now for the translation in Spanish. Y ahora para la versión original en español. 
he ido marcando. He ido marcando con cruces de fuego el atlas blanco de tu cuerpo. Mi boca era una araña que cruzaba escondiéndose en ti, detrás de ti, temorosa, sedienta. Historias que contarte a la orilla del crepúsculo, muñeca triste y dulce, para que no estuvieras triste. Un cisne, un árbol, algo lejano y alegre. El tiempo de las uvas, el tiempo maduro y frutal. Yo que viví en un puerto desde donde te amaba, la soledad cruzada de sueño y de silencio, acorralada entre el mar y la tristeza, callado, delirante, entre dos condoleros inmóvil, entre los labios y la voz, algo se va muriendo. Algo con alas de pájaro, algo de angustia y de olvido. Así como las redes no retienen del agua. Muñeca mía, apenas quedan gotas temblando. Sin embargo, algo canta. Entre estas palabras fugaces, algo canta, algo sube hasta mi vida boca. Oh, poder celebrarte con todas las palabras de alegría, cantar, arder, huir como un campanario en las manos de un loco. Triste ternura mía, ¿qué te haces de repente? Cuando he llegado al vértice más atraído y frío, mi corazón se cierra como una flor nocturna. Thank you for that reading. Every day you play, every day you play with the light of the universe. Subtle visitor, you are arrived in the flower and the water. You are more than this white hat that I hold tightly as a cluster of fruit. Every day between my hands, you are like nobody since I love you. Let me spread you out among yellow garlands. Who writes your name in letters of smoke among the stars of the south? Oh, let me remember you as you were before you existed. Suddenly the wind howls and bangs at my shut window. The sky is a net crumb with shadowy fish. Hear all the winds, let go sooner or later, all of them. The rain takes off her clothes. The birds go by fleeing. The wind, the wind. I can contend only against the power of man. The storm whirls dark leaves and turns loose all the boats that were moored last night to the sky. You are here. Oh, you don't run away. You will answer me to the 
last cry. Cling to me as though you were frightened. Even so, at one time a strange shadow ran through your eyes. Now, now too, little one, you bring me honeysuckle, and even your breasts smell of it, while the sad wind goes slaughtering butterflies. I love you, and my happiness bites the palm of your mouth. How you must have suffered getting accustomed to me, my savage, solitary soul, my name that sends them all running. So many times we have seen the morning star burn, kissing our eyes, and over our heads they gray light unwinding tawny fan. My words reigned over you, stroking you. A long time I have loved the sun, mother of pearl of your body. I go so far as to think that you own the universe. I will bring you happy flowers from the mountains, bluebells, dark hazels and rustic buckets of kisses. I want to do with you what spring does with the cherry trees. Juegas todos los días. Juegas todos los días con la luz del universo. Sutil visitadora, llegas en la flor y en el agua. Eres más que esta blanca cabecita que aprieto como un racimo entre mis manos cada día. A nadie te pareces desde que yo te amo. Déjame tenderte entre guirnaldas amarillas. ¿Quién escribe tu nombre con letras de humo entre las estrellas del sur? Ah, déjame recordarte cómo eras entonces, cuando aún no existías. De pronto, el viento aula y golpea mi ventana cerrada. El cielo es una red cuajada de peces sombrios. Aquí vienen a dar todos los vientos, todos. Se desviste la lluvia. Pasan huyendo los pájaros. El viento, el viento. Yo solo puedo luchar contra la fuerza de los hombres. El temporal Arremolina, hojas oscuras y suelta todas las barcas que anoche amarraron al cielo. Tú estás aquí, a tú no huyes. Tú me responderás hasta el último grito. Ovillate a mi lado como si tuvieras miedo. Sin embargo, alguna vez corrió una sombra extraña por tus ojos. Ahora, ahora también, pequeña, me traes madre selvas. Y tienes hasta los sueños perfumados. Mientras el viento triste galopa, matando mariposas, yo te amo. Y mi alegría muerte tu boca de ciruela. Cuánto te habrá dolido acostumbrarte a mí, a mi alma sola y salvaje, a mi nombre que todos ajuyentan. Hemos visto arder tantas veces el lucero besándonos los ojos 
y sobre nuestras cabezas destorcerse los crepúsculos en abanicos gigantes. Mis palabras llovieron sobre ti acariciándote. Amé desde hace tiempo tu cuerpo de nacar soleado, hasta te creo dueña del universo. Te traeré de las montañas flores alegres, copi huevos, avellanas oscuras y cestas silvestres de besos. Quiero hacer contigo lo que la primavera hace con los cerezos. The next poem is called uh, I like for you to be still. I like for you to be still. It is as though you were absent and you hear me from far away and my voice doesn't touch you. It seems as though your eyes had flown away and it seems that the kiss had sealed your mouth as all things are filled with my soul you emerge from the things filled with my soul you are like my soul a butterfly of dream and you are like the word melancholy I like for you to be still and you seem far away It sounds as though you were lamenting a butterfly, cooling like a dove. And you hear me from far away. My voice doesn't reach you. Let me come to be still in your silence. And let me talk to you with your silence. That is bright as a lamp, simple as a ring. You are like the night with its stillness and constellations. Your silence is that of a star as remote and candid. I like for you to be still. It is as though you were absent, distant and full of sorrow as though you had died one word then one smile is enough and i'm happy happy that is not true very nice reading Nordrick. i liked it a lot it's a beautiful Thank poem you. Y ahora la traducción, va, la versión original. Me gustas cuando callas. Me gustas cuando callas. Porque estás como ausente. Y me oyes desde lejos. Y mi voz no te toca. Parece que los ojos se te hubieran volado y parece que un beso te cerrará la boca. Como todas las cosas están llenas de mi alma, emerges de las cosas, llena del alma mía. Mariposa de sueño, te pareces a mi alma y te pareces a las palabras de melancolía. Me gustas cuando callas y estás como distante y estás como quejándote mariposa en arrullo y me oyes desde lejos y mi voz no te alcanza. Déjame que me calle con el silencio tuyo. Déjame que te hable también con tu silencio. 
clavo, como una lámpara, simple como un anillo. Eres como la noche, callada y constelada. Tu silencio es de estrella, tan lejano y sencillo. Me gustas cuando callas porque estás como ausente, distante y dolorosa, como si hubieras muerto. Una palabra entonces, una sonrisa bastan y estoy alegre, alegre de que no sea cierto. Thank you, Cordell. It was an excellent reading. I actually could picture this poem while you read it in Spanish without understanding Spanish. So... Thank you. <laughs> Your reading was very good, too. Mm, thank you. Uh, <laughs> guys, that will be it for today's episode. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe to Cordell's videos on Minds. All the all the links are just below this video. Join us on Pindar and we would like to hear your poems too. And thank you for being with us. Bye. Goodbye everyone and have a good day, good afternoon and good evening.